for a matter of seconds. Yeah. It just, the front door came in and slid across the floor. A grandmother, two grandchildren, a son-in-law, all victims of the tornado that hit Winterset. Two neighbors also died. Six other people were seriously injured from that storm. That storm system was destructive and especially long lasting this weekend. Good evening and thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Dave Price. I'm Janae Town. Six people died in Winterset. A seventh person died nearly 60 miles away in Lucas County, making this the deadliest tornado to hit our state in nearly 13 years. Now, one young boy has lost his little brother, his little sister, grandmother and father, and his mother is critically injured. The boy and seven family members were in the Baisley's home along Carver Road in Winterset when that tornado hit last night. The grandmother, Melissa Baisley, died. Her husband and son survived. Now, Melissa's daughter's family had been visiting from Blue Springs, Missouri. Her son-in-law, 37-year-old Mike Bolger, died. So did five-year-old Kinley and two-year-old Owen. Melissa's daughter, Curie, is in critical condition tonight. A friend has set up a GoFundMe account to help the survivors with medical and funeral expenses. Just search Help the Bolgers during a time of need if you want to find this online. Two of Melissa Baisley's neighbors along Carver Road also died. Authorities confirm 72-year-old Cecilia Lloyd and 64-year-old Rodney Clark both died. Altogether, six people in this area suffered serious injuries, according to the Madison County Emergency Management.